Yo, 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 what's good, Bully fam? TBK West back with another video. Today is a good day. You know, we're making good progress. We got an uh, update for my girl, Cardi. Uh, if you guys follow my channel, you guys have seen I did the AI on her with my boy, Louie. Uh, it looks like she took, uh, today is day 46, I think. And uh, she's already showing. She was showing at like day 35. Usually if your dog is showing like around day 30, day 35, yeah, it's really no need to do the sonogram. You know, you go, you're supposed to do the x-rays around day 50, 55. Um, I don't really, I used to do both. I might do it just for y'all, but I usually don't do it because I just, you know, once I can see something in there, we'll just see what it is, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I might take her over to uh, Gulf Gate Pet Hospital to get an uh, x-ray just for y'all so we can see how many's in there. My guess, at first I was thinking it was like two, you know what I'm saying? I asked the kids, they were saying it's looking like it's only two or three. But as the days went on, I, I think it's like four to six now. So yeah, we're gonna see, man. Uh, Cardi's a good dog. She, um, her first litter was like seven pups. So we'll see what she's throwing this time, man. And um. I'm gonna uh, put her on camera soon. I'm gonna give y'all some footage of her so you can see how she's looking. And uh, yeah, man, when her pups do drop, I will get. I'll be taking footage. I'm gonna be recording everything. So I record when the pups get here. Show you guys what she threw. Um, I, this is a repeat breeding. Uh, last time I bred her to Louie, we had. Uh, uh, a blue and tan, black and tan, two fawns, and two uh, blue and whites. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, I think it was one, no, it wasn't no, yeah, I think that was it right there. Anyway, yeah, so, like I said, I'm anxious to see what she's gonna get, or right, what, what, what she's gonna throw, and uh, I also uh, will be using, as y'all can see the back there, I, I like to use the incubator. You know, some people, you just keep it in the pool. If you keep your, uh, your your room that the dogs are in at a good temperature, nice and warm, some people use heating pads. Whatever you use, it's gotta make sure it's nice and warm for the pups, you don't want them to get sick. Also, you wanna also use, um. well for me, I use, I don't wanna give you guys no recommendations, but for me, I use, uh, Oxy Mama after the pups are born. This helps to produce milk. And, uh, you know, also puts vitamins in the milk because the reason why I was saying that if the room temperature isn't right, if it's too cold in the room, then, you know, um, the pups could get kennel cough. You know what I'm saying? So these type of vitamins. Also, I use, I use Oxymate too as well. So you put these, I mean, give your dog these with a uh, wild She's pregnant and after, also before I believe too. And I also use bitch pills, you know what I'm saying? So I use all three of those. They put vitamins in the milk so the pups won't get sick regardless of the temperature. Um, for anyone who uses the incubator, you know that it's nice, good temperature in there, but when you bring them out, they could get sick if the room is cold, you know what I mean? So just gotta make sure that your, your uh, female is using I'm sorry, producing good, healthy milk with the uh, with the vitamins and minerals inside of it. Yes, sir. And uh, what else was I going to talk with y'all today about? Um, we got. Um, let me see. Oh, you gotta go to the bathroom. All right. Uh, I'm gonna let Cardi out real quick. Also, uh, we got. We're still waiting for Trinity. To come in so she can do her thing and we're also waiting for valencia and sprinkles to do their thing i forgot we got sprinkles over at og weasel's house um she's looking great beautiful i'll go get some uh i'm gonna go over there and get some video of her so i can show you guys man and uh like i said uh just another bully another vlog from the tbk west trilateral bully camp 
Thank y'all for tuning in. I'm going to get to this footage, man. All right, if you like this content, like and subscribe, bro. It's day 45, y'all, so as you can see, my hands aren't that big, but I say this is at least about four to six, you know what I'm saying? I'm not sure, but we shall see, shall we? <laughs> yeah, man, as y'all can see, young Cardi got a nice little full load in there. nipples are real sensitive right now she love when i it's like a massage you know if you do this but anyway guys yeah so this is a cardi update i told y'all what we got last time i'm looking for the uh you know the blue and tans black and tans if we get that that's cool if we don't then you know we'll see what's up man and hopefully we get some females because I do need to keep at least one or two females based on how my yard is right now. But I don't normally do that. You know, you got some breeders who keep all the pups. I don't do that, man. I, you know, we uh, would like to find them some nice, wonderful, beautiful homes. So, uh, yeah, I'm not in the business of keeping all the dogs, but uh, <laughs> that's my incubator right here. I was telling y'all about clean her up, get her ready to go. Yes, sir. Yes, indeed. We're going to get it going, Bully fam. Thanks for tuning in, man. This is TVK West signing out. Me and Cardi out of here. Peace, peace, peace. We just roll that butter. We just roll that butter. We just roll that butter. We just roll that